Hi, I'm Dave Sobirai at Patch.com. We're here at a key Alpha League matchup today between the Sierra Canyon Trailblazers and the Campbell Hall Vikings. <laughs> Both teams are ready, so let's go to the highlights. Austin McBroom starts the game off right with a smooth jump shot at the top of the key. Sierra Canyon answers when Julian Brooks fires the no-look pass to Jesse Howell inside. Then, Jeremy Clark hits the shot in the corner to give the Vikings an early 7-4 lead. It continues to go back and forth. Daniel Cohen gets the steal, and Jamel Taylor makes the acrobatic shot in the lane. The Vikings are back in transition. This time, KJ Smith creates on his own with a beautiful spin move. On the next possession, the Trailblazers come back with a great entry pass from Jamel Taylor to Marcellus Johnson, and Johnson does the rest. Austin McBroom gives the Vikings a four point lead at the end of the first, but he was just getting started. The score 17 13 Vikings after one. The Vikings get out to a quick start in the second when Zach Klein connects from downtown. Then Austin McBroom shows a great individual effort when he swats the Trailblazer shot and takes it coast to coast with the runner in the paint to take a nine point lead but that only blazed a newfound fire under Sierra Canyon. Jesse Howell swings it to Julian Brooks in the corner for the tray and Brian Alberts dials up from long distance but Austin McBroom penetrates and gets the shot and one to make it 28-21, Campbell Hall. The Trailblazers answer when Marcellus Johnson flies for the two-handed jam and the Trailblazers mascot Blaze is all pumped up. He'd have even more reason to cheer after this pretty alley-oop from Daniel Cohen to Julian Brooks and Marcellus Johnson goes up strong to finish the first half. He'd finish with 12 points. The score, 31-28 Trailblazers after a 10-0 run to finish the half. Sierra Canyon continued its run early in the third. First, Daniel Cohen hits the shot and one. Then, Jamel Taylor makes the perfect bounce pass to Julian Brooks for the easy bucket. He'd finish with 11. And Daniel Cohen finishes the 19-0 run with a pull-up J in the corner. The Vikings trail 40-28, but Austin McBroom keeps his team in it with this jumper to cut it to a six point game. But Brian Alberts takes matters into his own hands with a step back J to finish the quarter. The score, 46-38 Sierra Canyon. The fourth quarter starts with one of Julian Brooks's five assists to Marcellus Johnson underneath. And later, Jamel Taylor hits a clutch shot plus the foul to put the Trailblazers up by nine. But the Austin McBroom show kept sweeping until the bitter end. He hits the tray, that takes the shooter's roll around the rim, and he follows that up with an amazing shot in traffic to bring his team within three points late. He finished with a game-high 36, but it wasn't enough after Jesse Howell cleans up his own miss to put the Trailblazers ahead by multiple possessions. The final score, the Sierra Canyon Trailblazers 60 and the Campbell Hall Vikings 53. I think we uh, played as a team today and uh, everyone came out playing hard together and uh, came out with a win. We need to um, play better as a team, uh, both offense and defense still. Defense wins game, we need to lock up people on defense, uh, rebound, and um, hopefully have Cole back for our next game and be back together as a full unit. I think we played as a team today, you know, looking for each other and play, played great defense on, their, on Austin McBroom, stopped him. And um, I think that's about it. We just need to capitalize more on offense, but other than that, we did pretty well.